Hey YouTube, welcome back to the next episode of the Sims 4 Joy of Life Challenge. We are back in today's stream and I'm very, very excited because it is officially the twins' birthday today. They're aging into children. So if you guys are excited, go ahead and click the like button and subscribe if you are new. But you might also notice the messages down below right here. These are from our friends over on Twitch, which if you guys want to come and join this series live, the link will be in the description as always. And I hope you guys enjoy today's video. Let's go ahead and jump right in. Okay, so guys, I've got lots of plans in today's episode, okay? So I've got like got the whole, I got the whole episode basically planned out. So if we go ahead and have a look at our calendar today, we can see that technically it was the kiddo's birthday. It's technically Charlotte and um, it's technically Charlotte and Reese's birthday today. But obviously we're a little bit busy because Neve had to go and give birth to these little children who are kicking up a stink, which actually I'm going to go get her some food because she's hungry right now. And then we'll, I will explain as we go. Um, go and grab some creamy soup with salmon because that sounds really good. Leave the kids, okay? Emiliano, make yourself useful, darling. Okay, have you changed the baby's nappy yet? Emiliano, you've got one job, baby. Change your child's nappy. Guys, I'm supposed to be relaxing here. I'm supposed to be being calm. Um, this is not helping. <laughs> This is not helping. I don't feel calm right now. Right, so guys, what I was trying to say is it's technically the kid's birthday today. As you can see, they're supposed to be aging up today. But obviously we can't really throw them a birthday party since it's already like 10 p.m. So what we're going to do is we're going to make them a cake and we're going to age them up tonight so that we don't forget their birthday because it is technically their birthday day. And then tomorrow on Sunday, we're actually going to throw their birthday party. So they're already going to be kids then. Obviously, we're not going to do the cake blowing out there, but we can have a cake there and then obviously they can eat it. So yeah, we're going to do like cake today and then birthday party tomorrow but i've got a really really cute plan for their birthdays we're gonna be going to a water park that i placed down and customized i'm really excited so we're gonna take them to a water park for their birthdays i think it's gonna be really fun so we're gonna bake a cake for them maybe we do just a chocolate cake because honestly chocolate cake is like the best cake let's be honest <laughs> I'm just gonna make a chocolate cake. It's not that big of a deal. Oh, Queenie, I think she's waiting for her food. Can you come and fill the bowl, Emiliano? Yeah, she's hungry. Come and fill it for her, <laughs> please. There you go, come and eat, Queenie. <laughs> oh no, Queenie's afraid of the stove. You're gonna have to get used to it, honestly, because we bake in that like every day. <laughs> right, let's add birthday candles. Here we go. Okay, so the kids have already started putting themselves to bed. Honestly, Charlotte is such a little early. Like, you know, normally toddlers kick up a stink and never want to go to bed. Charlotte is like the complete opposite. She always puts herself to bed. Reese, on the other hand, normally, um, you know, is a little bit more difficult to get him to go to bed. All right, we're going to help blow out candles. We'll do Charlotte first since she technically was the oldest. <laughs> okay, here we go. She's oh, aging up. Oh, oh, she's getting changed. Oh, oh, yeah, of course. Queen needs to get changed before she ages up. Oh, okay, I see. Let's go all the way outside. Yep, got to make a big spectacle about it. Make sure everyone outside walking past can see her aging up. So, this is kind of important, guys. What do I do for her traits and aspiration? Because we don't know if Charlotte's going to be the heir for the challenge or whether Reese is gonna be the heir, or whether the two new children are gonna be the heirs. So, I don't know whether I should do a trait that kind of suits next gen or, or what, I'm really not sure. Okay, you know what, let's just take a quick look at what traits we need for the next gen, and then we can see if they actually fit in with it. If not, then we can sort of go by there. Right, so generation two, the traits that they need to have are ambitious, and we can roll or pick the rest. Okay, so technically speaking, anybody can be our Gen 2 heir because they you, they only need to be ambitious and then we can roll or pick all the rest of their traits. So realistically, we can just, you know, choose whatever we want. Okay, I'll tell you what. Normally what I do is I always randomize my Sims traits uh, three times. Okay, right. So let's see what she gets. So the first one is loves the outdoors. I mean... She hasn't really spent much time outdoors, but she is a toddler, so I don't know. A goofball, these sims tend to be playful. She has always been a bit of a goofball, but I don't know. Or high-spirited, which means she's very energetic, playful, um, and happy life doing exciting things. I'm kind of leaning towards high-spirited or goofball. She was a bit of an aggressive baby, wasn't she? So, like, she was just high in spirits when she, like, kicked the living hell out of 
like all of her parents' shins. <laughs> okay, aspiration. Yeah, so I'm kind of leaning towards social, but there is actually a motor skill that we can do. Yeah, life of the party in a uniquely creative way. Oh, I don't know. Okay, I'll tell you what, we'll do a randomizer. I'll do a randomizer on it. Okay, it was two. So if it's two, then it's gonna be slumber party animal. <laughs> and she also gets to start with level two in every skill so far, which is great. Okay, let's have a look. How does she look? Right, this is with no CC applied, by the way, guys. Okay, she's looking like the Grinch right now. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Just wait till we give her a CC, okay? <laughs> okay, next up is Reese. Let's go ahead and get him aged up. Let's go. Oh my God, baby, are you crying? Oh no, Bubba's crying. Okay, hold on, baby care, bottle feed. Okay, next up, little baby Reese is aging up. Happy birthday. Oh, is he going outside too? What little drama queens we've got. <laughs> okay, here we go. Right, Reese has just aged up. Right, so we'll do the same thing. We'll randomize three times and pick our favorites. So we have open-minded, um, vegetarian. They avoid eating foods that contain meat products or unappeasable. They find it hard to be satisfied and they're often bored and need more sources of excitement. Out of those three traits, which one is more leaning towards Reese? Open-minded? Yeah, I thought the same thing too. Okay, aspiration. So this says that they're more open-minded and they gain the creative skills faster. It kind of has me lean more towards creative. We could also go for creative genius, which means they want to build their creative and mental skills. Yeah, creative genius? Okay, let's do it. Okay, right, these kids are going to need some work. <laughs> right, let's go into Cass as soon as possible and then let's just save them. Yeah. Okay, what have we got? This is interesting, guys. Okay, so the teeth, they're going to be a no from me, guys. I think, guys, what we're going to do is just bring the lips down at the edges just here. And we're also going to adjust the chin a little bit. Yeah, okay. We're just going to pull that in. Now she's looking way cuter. She had curls as a toddler, so I kind of want to match up to that. Okay, for now, we're just going to go with this one. It'll have to do. Then we need to do some eyelashes. Oh, maybe those. I'm not sure about the lips, but I've got a lip mask that I could add over the top. Oh, okay. I think I like those lips. Those ones work. She had this and she also had Naomi freckles. So let's make sure that we match those up. And I think she had those. And then her nose. Um, she had a nose bridge mask. That one. Oh, she had that one as a kiddo. So we'll give her that one back as well. This is her... Um, looking like what she looked like as a toddler, at least with her skin details matching up. That's how she should look. Ooh, I don't mind that hair on her, actually. Maybe this one? That one's cute, too. Right, we'll go for this. Um, I don't know if these are the correct eyes. They might need to be slightly darker, but for now, I'm not sure. Yeah, I think she had those. We'll swap to those then. Right, let's do her outfit, guys. Let's go ahead and do it. I'm kind of leaning towards one of these. I don't know. What do you guys think? Maybe one of these? Maybe we go for the green. Like a nice top and jeans. Okay, fine. Surely this is giving popular girl. Definitely, yeah? Okay, this is it. Okay, we're on the right vibe. Okay, skirt could be an option. Yeah, the skirt is cute. Okay, see? See, I'm popular, guys. I'm so popular, I can feel it. <laughs> Maybe those with like some little socos. Okay, so Charlotte's looking hella cute. Honestly, she's looking really sweet. Right, so this is her formal wear. Um, so this will be what she wears when there's like family parties or potentially when her mum and dad get married. So I think maybe we just go for a cute dress or something maybe something like this oh that is so cute okay maybe we go for this one since it's a little bit fancier and let's go with some little white shoes okay what do you guys think about that yeah okay let's go let's go for it in this color then and i might also go with a little necklace she's wearing gold earrings i like that one that one looks really pretty right athletic wear what do we think about that with the white maybe We'll pair it with um, the trainers that she had on earlier. These ones. Oh, wait, what about this? I mean, bougie. <laughs> I'm kind of leaning towards it in this one like that. Yeah, we might go for the two, two pigtails for athletic wear. I'm trying to figure out what to give her for a sleepwear as well. I'm literally not finding anything. Maybe this one? 
like that. Okay, this is her party wear. I wanted to go for this one. Okay, is it just me who thinks she suits the blush pink more? Is it just because I'm having a really big thing with blush pink? We need some color variety. I mean, I did give her other color variety. Like I gave her blue there. I gave her blush pink. I gave her green, see? There was color variety, come on. Okay, swimwear. I actually like this swimwear on her. I think I might even keep this one. Maybe the green, maybe like that. Oh yeah, the yellow one is nice though. And I might, I'm gonna leave her hair down. Or do I put her hair up? Maybe I put it up in a little bun while she's swimming like that. <gasps> Ooh, this dress is so cute for hot weather. All of these are super cute for her. Oh, I kind of like that one. Okay, what about this one for cold weather? Honestly, we're probably never gonna see her cold weather. They live in like Italy, basically. Realistically, we are never gonna see this. So <laughs> maybe just go for the gray one. Oh, I don't know, maybe the black. Let's go for the black, the black's cute. Okay, right, so Charlotte is finished. What do you guys think of her? Now it's time to give Reese a makeover. Oh, wow. Well. Reese, baby, you are gonna need some help. Bubba, you are gonna need some help. I don't know what happened to his nose. I don't know. I'm gonna make his nose a bit bigger. I don't wanna change him too much. All right, let's just, let's just add the skin. Let's add the skin and we'll, we'll decide where we go from here. Oh, the skin did save it though. The, okay, the skin is saving it. The skin is working. He looked like this as a little kiddo. So let's see if we can match it up. Okay, I'm not too sure what we wanna do for him yet. I actually kind of like that one on him, actually. That hair. Maybe those. He looks really angry. And then I'll give him some eyelashes too. Those ones, I think. He needs a more rounded face. I can already tell that this jawline is going to cut when he gets older. Let me tell you guys. This jawline is going to... Mm, it's going to be... Mm, it's just... It's in the making right now. He had on this nose mask here. He has the same nose bridge as his mum. So we'll give him that one as well. Okay, guys, <laughs> he's gonna be so freaking cute when he grows up. I can feel it. And he has these ones, the third one along like that, like his dad. Right, so Reese is open-minded and he's gonna be a creative genius. So we're kind of going the creative route for him. Okay, what about this shirt with some jeans? <gasps> Ooh, this could be cute with some black shoes. Okay, I think I like this outfit. See, you see why they needed me here, guys? Because I can't let this disaster get out of Cass. Look at it. That's, that is a disaster. All right, this is gonna be his outfit that he'll wear to his mum and dad's wedding, which for now, I'm just gonna go with the black and white, but we'll probably change it. Oh, I actually like this. Um, I like that, that tracksuit top. Just gotta pair it with some, um, some running trousers like that that could work i like that actually okay this could work the red definitely could work with maybe something like that that's cute i like that right this is his party wear outfit oh my god that's the exact same shirt that his dad wears as well that is so cute okay maybe we go for it in brown maybe these let's go for loafer type things okay that'll do swimwear I like those already, they're fine. Um, hot weather wear. Maybe we go with a marble top. Uh, let's pair him with some shorts. And then sandals, we'll get them in black. Okay, cold weather wear. This one is cute. Let's pair this with some jeans. Like that. And some boots. Okay, there we go. Right, Reese is done. What do you guys think of him? I'm, uh, I did just put this hair on him and kind of just settle with it, but I am considering changing it. Although I need to keep the curliness um, to it. So this long hair is growing on me. I don't know why, but I kind of like this one. He looks like his dad, doesn't he? He definitely looks like his dad with that one. I like it. I like that hair. We're gonna, we're gonna stick to this one with the long one. All right, let's go upstairs. Oh, I do need to do the bedroom renovations. I need to move their bedrooms into this bedroom. Okay, I've got an idea. Right, we're gonna get rid of this, okay? We're gonna get rid of this. We'll get rid of the baby stuff. For now, I'm just gonna buy them beds. And then I will do the renovations in the next episode. I think we'll do it like that. 
Oh, these beds are cute. I think I'm going to go with that one. And uh, we'll do the bottom bunk for Charlotte. And the top bunk will be Reese's. There. They've got beds to sleep in. That's all we need for now. Okay, it's it's a renovation, guys. A renovation in progress. <laughs> okay, Charlotte, come get some sleep. Reese, come get some sleep too. Neve, um, she's already heading off to bed. She said, I am done here. Oh, look at him and little Ginger. Oh my God, look at them. Oh, they're so cute. I love that. Okay, go put her down so that you can get some sleep. Not Queenie wanting to play ball at one o'clock in the morning. Like, babes, go to bed. Okay, who's crying? Who is it? Oh my god. Okay, you need to be taken care of. Shh. Quiet. <gasps> You've got to be kidding me. You have got to be kidding me. Neve is bleeding, and this feels like much more than regular postpartum bleeding. She needs to go to the hospital. Oh my god, I swear to god, if Neve dies right now, I will lose my mind. I will cry. I will cry myself to sleep, please. Okay, Emiliano and Neve need to go to the hospital, like, now. Postpartum hemorrhage. Neve is feeling very dizzy due to severe blood loss. Oh my god, go to the hospital, please. Please come back. Oh my god, I need to know what's going on. I need to know what's going on. I'm so scared. This isn't very joyful of life right now. <laughs> I'm, I can't. If Neve dies, I will cry. <gasps> oh my God. She lives. <gasps> I thought for sure she died. <gasps> oh my God. Neve's bleeding was immense, but the doctors worked tirelessly and were able to get it under control in time. They administered contracting medicines, which worked as intended. And Neve should be just fine, but she needs to take it easy. And she has to remain in the hospital for the next two days. She's not going to be there for her kid's birthdays. No. Oh, okay. Honestly, I should just be happy that she lived. I really should. Oh, no. The birthday party is going through. Emiliano is going to have to step the F up. Come on, daddy, Emiliano. You need to bring it out. Why are you crying? What do you want from me, Graham? Okay. I really don't know what the, I really don't know what he wants. I'm going to find out what's wrong. Okay. His nappy is changing. I can see that. I can see it. Well, at least Reese has woken up. Maybe their grandma would come over to help take care of the kids in the meantime. Should we, ha should we, um, should we have her come over and help? We're going to have Emiliano call up his mum. Let his mum know that Neve is currently in hospital. She had some postpartum bleeding and hemorrhaging. It was pretty bad, but luckily the doctors managed to keep it under control. Although I'm here with the kids. I'm stressed, mum. I'm tired. Look how tired he is, guys. Please come over. I need help. It's the kids' birthdays today. It's a disaster, mum. Please. Oh my god. Okay, I think his mum's gonna come over and help. Okay, I'm gonna have a stay over. We're gonna do it for the next two nights because I think that's how long Neve's gonna be in the hospital for. And we're gonna have um, Carolina come over and help. So let me have her. And she's gonna come over. She's gonna be there. Okay, so they live probably about two or three hours away. So I'm gonna have her arrive at 11 because she's gonna catch a flight and then get over. So we'll go for 11. Oh, the twins are gonna sit and chat in the in the kitchen. I'm guessing um, they've realized that their mum's not here. Okay, well, we need, we kind of need to get ready for the party. So we're gonna throw a birthday party. Um, we're doing it for Charlotte and Reese because they're the birthday sims. The guest is gonna be Emiliano. Unfortunately, Neve is not gonna be able to make it. We're also gonna invite Carolina and Bernard there. We'll also invite Enzo, the kid's uncle, and also their auntie. Daniela and Amani, the kid's um, aunties. Um, and we are throwing this at the Turtle Island water park. We're gonna get there for 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Um, I'm gonna have to invite over Daniela. Okay, really quick, if I have Emiliano come down to Daniela, and then in actions, we should have Beatrice and Grace that we can invite over, and then I should be able to invite them to the party. Come and say hello to Beatrice, and then she can invite, she can be invited to the party. And then this is um, Grace. Okay, say hello to Grace as well, and then I'll invite these. Okay, right, now I can go and update here and I can add them on as guests. I should be able to at least. Yeah, Grace and Beatrice. There we go, okay. Oh, Emiliano's so tired. I'm gonna have him go make a coffee. We need something strong. 
go and make an espresso. <laughs> he is struggling, guys. He's struggling right now. <laughs> this is going to be the worst birthday party ever. Charlotte will remember this. Charlotte's like so ready, excited for her birthday. I'm sorry, babes. I'm sorry. Honestly, pure chaos. The fact that Neve is currently asleep in the hospital. I have four kids and one sim to control them all. Guys, it is, it's rough in here. It is seriously rough. I can't believe he's put this entire thing together himself. Okay, the birthday party is about to begin. Let's go. Oh my God, you've got to be kidding me. Reese is coming down with something. I don't care. Yeah, I planned this entire thing. I'm so upset that like nothing's gone to plan. Like this is just, this is just me. Like really what do we expect? So I was in the middle of planning for like a really cute little thing to go on over here. So let's do it now. Okay, so first things first, I want to get the presents down. Let's go and do that now. Okay, so I've got this little um, table, which is going to be their birthday table. So we will pop that right here. That's for all their birthday presents. And then I'm also going to go ahead and grab um, a little birthday stack as well to go right there. And that'll be like extra presents for them. Oh, balloon hats for you and your guests. Hold on. That is so cool. Guys, I installed loads of mods for this. Like, honestly, I would have been so prepped. I am so sad that this is this is what's going as planned, but it's fine. Let's get some balloons here. And then I'll also get some uh, balloons to go on the tables as well. There we go. Okay, we've got some balloons here. I also installed a, a bunch of other mods for like parties. Okay, this was for the face painting. What else am I missing, guys? Oh, music, good point. We will pop that right there. Okay, I think we are good. I think that's everything that I wanted to add. Let's get everyone in a group <laughs> together. So if I go actions and then I can form group with, let me make sure that all the kids are at least coming over and then everyone can come and, uh, Grab some drinks, I guess. Oh, uh, turn on. So I was thinking we would do like kids music since it's supposed to be like a kid's birthday party. Oh, let's go play on the thing together. Let's go play pirates. Oh my God, look, we can make so many friends. Who's this? Kaylee and Cameron. Oh my God. Go make friends, kids. Go on, go and enjoy your birthdays. Oh my God, look how cute she looks. Oh, she looks so cute. Oh, I love these guys so much. Oh, and your auntie's coming with you. That's so cute. I'm going to have you introduce yourselves to these other kiddos as well. Oh, she wants ice cream. Guys, is there any sort of ice cream stand that I can buy her? My kid needs ice cream, okay? This needs to be the best birthday ever. Their, their mother is in hospital right now, guys. I need to have ice cream here. Right, if I do this one over here, I think I can actually get a little ice cream things set up over here okay can we actually have stuff served oh <gasps> this is gonna be so cool okay hire somebody to come and serve the kids ice cream this is gonna be the best birthday ever guys i'm so excited <laughs> oh my god not bernard looking amazing hey granddad how are you doing also i heard that you have a really big house in windenburg so maybe you can buy me an extra toy <laughs> she's begging for a toy did he give her one? Oh my god, he gave her one! Oh. Uh, okay, that was gonna be so cute. Anyways, Reese, what are you doing? Yes, kids. Look at him breaking it down. So cute. Love this. Oh, should we do face paints now? Or maybe pizza? Or ice cream? Wait, you said you wanted ice cream, right? Oh my god! Strawberry ice cream crepe? Oh my goodness. See, you said you wanted ice cream. Come and get yourself an ice cream. Oh, look how cool that is. Oh my God. Honestly, this is the best birthday. I mean, mum is in hospital, so it is a little sad, but this is pretty good. This is pretty good considering mum's not here. Oh my God, she gave herself brain freeze. <laughs> Emiliano is actually just living his best life out here. I am going to get him out of the pool though, because he's tired and he might actually die all right i'm gonna have uh emiliano go and sunbathe and get a little bit of a, like a nap in you know oh charlotte's playing with one of her new toys love that for her 
I'm gonna also complete this for her because she did have something. <gasps> okay, I really want everyone to go and uh, slide on the slides together. Slide with, um, let's bring Reese and your aunties and your uncle and granddad. Okay, who's next? Yes! Oh no, they were getting stuck. I thought they'd go into the water and swim around. <laughs> Guys, you can you can get down if you just jump in the water. Guys. <laughs> oh my god. Okay, stop. 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 Oh no. Charlotte, are you okay? Okay, I'm gonna get photos really quick before everyone leaves. Charlotte, it's your turn. Come on, baby. This is your time to shine. Right, take selfie with Reese. Yep, okay, get one with your brother first of all. Are you gonna take it in the water together? <gasps> this is gonna be such a cool photo. <laughs> what are these photos, guys? Okay, I like, actually, what is going on here? Love it how she's just cutting her brother out of the photos. <laughs> okay, just before we leave, I'm gonna go and get face paint for the kids. I'm gonna have her go for a butterfly. <gasps> guys! Oh my god, look how cool she looks! Reese, your turn. I'm gonna have Reese do. Let's do a dinosaur, because he's got dinosaur print on his um on his bed covers, on his new bed covers that he got for his birthday. So it's very fitting for him. Here we go. Oh <gasps> dinosaur Reese! You look so cute! Oh, these kids look so cute. Love them. Alright, Charlotte. Breaking it down. Go, kid. Yes. Take a selfie. Oh, my God. Look how freaking cute she looks. Oh, I love this baby. She looks so cute. She's in a really good mood as well. So we're getting some cute pics. Okay, let's have everybody come and um, grab some pizza together. And then we'll end this, uh, we'll end this birthday party. Honestly, guys... What do we think of this birthday party? I feel like it actually went really well. Oh, look at them! Hi, Uncle Enzo. Are you enjoying your pizza? Go and talk to me about school. Yeah, we're gonna open the presents after we finish eating. I love how everybody else has just turned up, like not even people at the party. Love that. Enzo and Charlotte just can't stop cracking up jokes. It's always a who. Oh, that's so cute. I love that for them. What a cute party. Yeah, I feel like it was really cute in the end. It is getting it is getting late though. We need to uh, finish up. And then the kids can come over and open their presents. So we will have Reese and um, Charlotte come and open their birthday presents. Okay, what did Reese get? What? He got a lump of coal? Are you kidding me? There's no way. Okay, what did Charlotte get? I can't believe someone gave him a lump of coal as a joke. Someone gave him a lump of coal. Charlotte got one leaf. <laughs> one leaf and one lump of coal. Are you kidding me? Okay, there's got to be some more gifts over here. Come and open one of these gifts. Come on, there's got to be another one over here. What did you get? It's too big to fit in her inventory. It'll be in her house on inventory. Okay. All right, let's have, um, let's have Reese come and open his present. He got money. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's my birthday. <laughs> okay, everyone, let's go. Um, let's go home. Honestly, it's been an amazing birthday. I've had such a good time, but it is 10 p.m. and you guys have got school tomorrow. <laughs> okay, you're gonna go have a shower for school tomorrow. Reese is being an artiste outside here. Um, Thank you so much for that. That's just amazing. Love this. Amazing. I had such a good time. Honestly, it was really, really good. I enjoyed the birthday so much. I'm really sad about Neve though, but she'll be back in the next episode, hopefully from um, from hospital because obviously she had childbirth complications. So yeah, she'll be back in the next episode. So we'll get a chance to see her because I did want to actually plan their wedding. But now that she's going to be gone for the next few days, I don't even know if we'll be able to do the wedding in the next episode or we'll have to do it the episode after because I need to make sure that she's well enough to be there at her wedding, you know? So 
I don't know. We'll speak about it in the next episode. Anyways, I love you guys so much. I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you did, remember to go ahead and leave it a like. Subscribe if you are new and ding the notification bell. You will get notified every single time I go live um, or upload. And speaking of going live, make sure you go ahead and follow me on my Twitch channel. Link down below. And make sure you also go ahead and follow me on all my socials. Link down below. I love you guys. And I'll speak to you in the next one. Bye, guys. Thank you.